Since I've been little, I've played basketball since I was like one years old. Just growing up and watching it, I've always wanted to do it and someday play on for his team, just like all the other players. There's pictures of me when I was one. I had a cast on my foot, but I was still dribbling the ball and shooting on a little, little uh, Fisher Price hoop. I've been on the bench since I was around nine years old, back in like 2005 when Kareem played. I was a really good team when they won the state championship. It's definitely an advantage for him. Uh, you know, he knows our routine. He's, that's why he's one of the captains as a junior this year. Uh, you know, he knows my expectations. Yeah, he's, he's used to the program. He's been around it for many, many years. At practice and games, I call him coach. And at home, I call him dad. And at home, it's a little more laid back. It's pretty tough for me at practice. I tend to treat CJ uh, the same as I treat all the other players on the team. When the game starts, uh, I, don't, I don't see it as a father-son relationship or in practice as a father-son relationship. I mean, his mother might say that I, I write him more than other players. Well, I've learned a lot from him over the years. And after every game, he remembers certain plays and talks about them, tells, tells me like, what went wrong, how it can change a game. So I've learned what not to do and also he points out positives, and I've just brought it all in since I was little. At the end of the day, uh, you always have that pride as a parent when your son is playing well, you know, doing things well, whether it's in the classroom or on the basketball court.